recognize When you see me with the match, don't ask me why I might run up on a nigga with a mask and blast the nine I might depart the spy, cause it's not hard to part the nine When you see me with the match, don't ask me why I might run up on a nigga with a mask and blast the nine I might depart the spy, cause it's not hard to part the nine Air things that happen through your lifetime that will show you Listen, am I a loyal dom or am I a joke dom? So all you got to remember is where you come from, the block where you was at, the people you started with, you get me? It don't matter what you see in this life, what money you make, what new friends come along. If you remember that loyalty, then your heart's nice and everybody who knows you knows you're nice. And you can always walk back to the block where you came from. They might see me outside with a star of gauge or pimmers are filled with niggas. I mean, real killers that's looking to block the day. I'm friends even, fam. That's why I'm that's why man's team was so many. I never have a lot of friends, fam. So not anyone could just come on the block and just chew it, man. No way. I would even try to pass. And then tell him, hey, yeah, peak. You're a gunner. Know what time it is? R8, real artillery. You know what I'm saying? I remember when I was starving for days and I flipped it. Yeah, I got a car and a chain, it's a stick thing. If you trespass my lanes on a bitch thing, you can get blossoms, braids. If you trims, get blossoms, fade. Hard as out, but I'm trying to stay far from the cage. Yeah, I got beef, but I'm trying to stay far from the grid. I don't know if I should be calling you RA or Slim right now, because we work. The Slim's going nasty up there. Yeah. Jungle, everyone's feeling the character, you get me? You shelled up the thing, but then you let your character go quick, move boy. Where's upset with that? Yeah, Seeing no, man obviously. like Sim lay down, move boy. What's <laughs> going on there? Yo, my G, what's good, Wagwan? Performance lit with your seatbelt on. I don't like waiting for people, I'm agitated. Look, keep calm. Uh, but we need to talk, my guy, because after this move, I'm done. Huh? Done? What do you mean done? You think that came with a gun for fun? We're moving mad, there's way more to life and I feel like Yo, you ain't moving right, but it took sense you knew this life Ready to eat this food tonight What do you mean? I gave man drops, I lined up shots and we've been eating A real talk fam, I ain't been sleeping Yo, we've been cool, why are you always Listen, beefing? I couldn't give a shit if you sleep or not I just wanna know if you pre this drop And all that I know is for one man's spot Look, you don't even need that glove huh? What do you mean I don't need this glove? Always have a gun when I scheme and rock You know I don't play, I've seen a lot Has he got the GD or he cooks that rock? Look, there's Bear GD and Grants, trust, it's easy fam. Yeah, you sound like an idiot, man. Let's just stick to the previous plan. No, this gun ain't gonna leave my hand. Disconnect the CCTV and keep your eyes open for the PC van. If you ask, I'm making this demon burn. Nah, you know, I can honestly, um, that's how it is, isn't it? With the movie, the script. Yeah. If I write it, then obviously I wouldn't have rubbed out so quick. Yeah. Because I never written it. That was just a script, innit? Saying so you have to go on it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah, my, my, my character was cold, Slim was a problem, still is a problem, and yeah, just watch out for me on this acting team. That's, yeah. that's what kind of pushes me on that school, you know what I'm saying? What the fuck? Why did you do that? You know this move was smooth, nothing to lose. Why did you shoot, man? Are you mad? Lower your phone when you're chatting to road, man. How do you drop your phone on the floor like a joke, man? No, but... You know I had to smoke, man. But what about what we said? Yo, strap that hole, man. Huh? You just see me throw, man. Pussy, act like you know, man. Fuck, you took this thing too far. I'm even gonna fix this. Tell me. There's some man in his head. So... No, it's probably dead. And? Did you see how we bled? Good. Now I'm thinking it's bad. Bits up. Why you acting like a bitch? I don't care if he dies. I don't care if he lives. But it ain't my biz. Yo, it is what it is, you sound like a snitch Man, you don't die for this shit Look, where if the neighbours saw me? I swear I got blood stains on my clothes And my girl's gonna ask me questions What do I say when I get back home? Yo, fuck your girl, you're picking up both Make you burn up phone on clothes Keep it hushed, this ain't no joke Remember, don't got shot, cause he shouldn't have spoke It look like acting to me That looked like the RA I remember yeah, from yeah. the road That script there, I made it mine Cause that's how I was back in the day as well Yeah It wasn't hard to do again So even when I did the script I didn't, I, I didn't even read everything that they were saying. Yeah. Like, I was like, bro, am I not feel like this? Yeah, you like, put yourself like into it. They said, I could do it your way. And I just put my whole way into it. I'm telling you, if you knew RA back in the day, ain't no acting out here. And RA's been greasy from an infant oh. creep by some of your former kids. And you don't want to see the replay. I got a serious guy with me all of the time, so I know for a fact that he sprays. So if mine jams, it do spray. Cause niggas get tapped up, one man escape to throw three's back up. I don't give a fuck, I'm clapping to my shots are done and then I'll back up. Cap, cap, cap. Yeah, let me talk about when I first knew I made was the hardest. 
That was about the time when I took the Stars PCD out of the car and put the RA real artillery in because there were no artists making me do that before him. Let me figure telling you when I knew he was a real one when his dobbies were carrying my boxes of entertainment down from the flats in his block after I'd had a big day and a bad load of money was made. You get me? Or maybe it was when I used to see him at three o'clock in the night on each strip passing me in his right and he'd be like, well, what are you saying, big man? Be safe and do your thing instead of asking me what I've got for him. The hardest and the realest fire came from Block 5. So it's only right that the hardest and the realest interviewer walked that block. You get me? Hear what I'm saying? Bear times Donnie's used to say to me, well, I'm not looking on the fight, that's all right, you know what he's on. Real boy, he gave me the pass. Walk with me. Before you step into part one of the most in-depth interview ever given to you by DRDIS TV and RA Real Artillery, understand what you're going to be watching. This isn't no footage based on rap or grime. This footage is based on fire. This is based on a time when a block had four spitters that were all fire. So walk with me as I remind you that at this time, the hardest block has got to be block five. There's no winning when you're fucking 100. Yeah? If the streets can't do you nothing because you're so hard, the fucking police will. Yeah? So this is what I'm saying to you. This block here, this took away hundreds of years of life to the cage. Yeah. Donnies that were real have sat in the fucking cells for so long that it counts over two Two and a half hundred years. <laughs> On the block now, it gives you different emotion. What would you say to any young youth that thinks he can be an RA out here? A lot of ends, a lot of people's listening to you and they want to be like you on this. What's your message for them? Listen, just do your thing, innit? But don't chat about the fuck you say. It don't make sense to me. You see that? Man won't believe you, know? obviously. We'll recognize you, man will see through you. That's just done with. Man was like one of the few that kind of made it through. Yeah. By the, by the, by the skin of man's teeth, you get me? Yeah. Yeah, so man's last of that dying breed, bro. So I, I definitely wouldn't say, no one don't need to try and be like me, bro. Yeah. Man's, man's not an example like that, you get me? Yeah. Man's trying to do better now, but the road team's dead, bro. Reality of bricks into the world. Fine. Sit back, relax, and learn the history of the gully side of South. I'm not talking about rap. I'm not talking about grime. I'm talking about fire. And that's what this block here behind me gave you and the people surrounding it. Tanner, Tentman, Shaq Kulian, Trips, Face, and the roadside G's. So walk with me as we take the steps. You know how it goes. Real recognize me. Oh, A back again. Yeah. Daily I roll with a mash again. And I don't mind that pen again. But if I go pen, I'll leave the stand and I'll be this. Yeah. Start again. Yeah. Start out shutting up, pulling tens. Start out dotting up, being tens. Yeah. Start up filling up line again. Niggas get robbed to play dumb. Frame in the boot till day comes. You get clapped with a grey gun. I win some dope refuse. Yeah, real recognize Rona. So obviously I'm up there, man. No hard, the hardest buff. Sappy yeah. with the dons or against the gang. Settlements fly the fence from man. When I'm beating the four pound in the corner, just bends on man. I'm like that was meant for man. Man, some real gangsters, not no rent a gang. I bang the burner hard like it's meant for man. I will ride out hard, so I won't tell no MC to send for man. Cause I got beef in the streets that know I got the sprays and, and plenty man in my team that beat the K's and empty mags. Real artillery, yeah, it's R A. Send the AR and the SLR our way. The price will pay that on a hard day. Cause we're always grinding. Like in and out of the kitchen, snapping the hard J. If the beef gets deep, clap at his margins. He thinks he's bad teaching the hard way. Burn him with the star way. Or run him over with the car way. Them niggas listen to House and Funky. We listen to Bounty Killer and Sister Kalungi. And SP and our own shit cause of grungy. 
Every day I'm in the jungle shutting them junkies. The four women will eat him up because I'm hungry. I don't want to beat him up and get my AJs and my Maharaji grungy. I don't do karate. <laughs> I ride the pumpy, fly free to Saatchi. You know that he's dungy. Right to the world and back to give me. Free the dogs, let me give me. Well, who made sure this was born? He was born that Sunday, 12.45. Yes. He came out, guns blazing. Yeah, because I remember Big Ben was right there to the window, <laughs> so we could see it. Um, and it was a bank holiday as well, wasn't it? Bank holiday. First bank holiday, 5-5. Five, five. Got in a 2-1. Yeah. Prime top of the year. Yeah. <laughs> Prime five chosen with well. There could be no other name for that him. Was, yeah, that's how we named him. That's how we named him that name. Josie Wills. The baddest thing for the Jamaica at the time. I don't think we're anything. We just spelled his name a little bit different though. The Spanish way. We just spelled it with yeah. two E's. Because of Ricardo was his. Yeah, he was going to be named Ricardo. But then he was just forever on this two thing, this gun. This gun business. And considering at that age as well, a couple of hours old, yeah. no coordination. <laughs> but the thing, it wasn't just that day. It was you like a whole time. It all the time. Yeah. You don't look at him in his cot and he's just lying when you wake up and he's just on it. <laughs> My life was kind of crazy, not just lyrics. Now I'm talking to these young duns because they're dumb with it. Mad car, every freaky done, I've already done, did it. Talking broad day, shoot outs, left none in it. Crazy car, wanna change a thing, not for one minute. Learn from my mistakes and pattern what I could have done different. Me and R was doing cyphers in the jailhouse. Yeah, RA, real artillery. Coming from a real nigga. You don't have to be a driller to be a real nigga. Fix up our uh, 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 Hashtag B U U U. Block behind me. Five. You get me? That's where the DR this TV started. But the journey never started there. The journey started back in the roads of Foxhall and the blocks of Kennington. So this part one, I'm gonna give you the truth the truth to the story of DR this TV how I started on the five and how I got there so basically down in the streets of Foxhall there was a man called Mark a hustler he showed me the way forward was entertainment and down in the blocks of Kennington was a man called Simon Scott he had the mixtape thing on lock that's right if you wanted a K slave a DJ clue an MV a big mic, he had that all up in his yard in Kennington. So he was hustling from his, let's say he was hustling from his room. I decided to take that further. So I hit the South London press and started looking for somewhere to hit. Somewhere in the streets of South, you get me? That took me to Lilford Road. And that's the first time I set eyes on anyone from the Block 5 hustling. Hustling D Block CDs, you get me? If you wanted anything from Styles P, Sheep Looch, Jay the Kiss, or Jay Hood, I had that. And that's how the journey started. 198, everyone, remember saying 198, Block 5, 198, back in from 2004. Ah. Oh. So this is where 198 started from. Like, you see that? A cold. Because we used to chill outside the yard, so we just said, yo, 198. I used to listen to ours before I ever met him, man. I used to listen to his music in school, do you get me? Yeah. I used to walk on them fucking old school phones with infrared and that. Them Sony Ericsson joints, fuck him. Yeah, so I used to, I, I, I knew about him already before I ever met him. See, you want some big bro? Oh, I'd never make you do something that you wouldn't do, you understand? Different for the rest of these orders, so like, you wouldn't put in the field knowing something's gonna happen to you. I swear up, put it on my left. I have known us from way back. I'm old school, like before Gangster Graham. Putting so much work and done things from time to time, good and bad. I'm talking from way down in our early teens, 2000s and before. Shut up, yeah. Oh, it's big homie, you get me? For the jump. Homeboys always show my love, looked out for my things, so naturally that's big bro, you get me? Yeah, most definitely, bro. Big up ours, 100 times, artists out, hands down. On this grease thing, they know this. I just eat a bag of 
Chinese with a grease in Now we stay and rise and pasture in the evening You can get captured if a cream And take it to a rundown house for the whole evening Me and my niggas there every day with no sleeping Nothing in the yard, no furniture, no heating Told you that we're half three days with no eating When my breath is squeezed, the cave with no breathing Stand up behind it, I rasp it with no leaning Dumb niggas beating a burner with no reason Bitch boy screaming murder but still breathing I've been on the block so you know I know what's going down man It's big bro's time, you feel me? Games are fraud, everybody's lost in it They came the source till they get washed in it Let's keep this real. You know how it is. There ain't nobody out there who ain't real. I mean, I've never met the Donny yet who told me he was a fake. So it's 2001 times, maybe a bit before, I end up on this block and the block surrounding it. The purpose to get that dough. The ties, none. I don't know a soul right there. I've got no family, no friends. But the mad thing is the boss of these blocks treated me like I was both. You get me? I'm out here early, I'm out here in the evening, I'm out here in the night. Sundays I'm out from the crack of dawn at the top of this road. If you know, you know. I'm getting paid. Not once did he ask me what have I got for him. Not once did he tell me to come off of this block. You get me? He left me to feed my kids. I'm in the boot cell innit, it's all got peak for me. Like I've got this renter community officer who thinks he's a fed coming in every week trying to fuck it up for me. So I've got to leave the fucking boot cell. I've got nowhere to go, you get me? My main people are all coming down for the entertainment on a Sunday. I'm stuck. So anyway, a woman comes through and she gives me a spot. She's got a flat up in the blocks. So obviously these blocks are ours, you get me? So I'm like, yeah, this woman's giving me a flat up there. She's like, I can run up in there every Sunday, you get me? And keep the entertainment going. So this is how he keeps it real. He's like, yeah, say nothing, big man. So Sunday's come now. He's got his Donnies in there helping me. That's how real the thing got. His Donnies are in there helping me, you get me? All Sunday, carrying down the bags when the work's finished. This is where you officially started the channel. Obviously this road here, anyone who's built to the Dons knows where this is, you get me? So we was on here, what is it, about 2.33 in the night. Early morning. Yeah, just come out of a mad session. One of those hits from the road side was on the horizon, you get me? The roads were soon to know. So anyway, we was out here, busting to Joe, you and all the official Donnies, and then someone started saying, right, what are you gonna call yourself? You get me, and you was telling me, what are you saying, what's your name? And then we started with a white phantom, you get me? <laughs> A man like me wanted then then to live, so I loved the phantom <laughs> talk you get me. <laughs> and then he said to me, Ra, what are you saying? D, obviously Darren, you get me. D artist, TV, you get me. So that's where it started, you get me. For them that don't know, D artist TV with a block five originated. Right in the smack band middle of the garrison as well. Ah, oh, whoosh, whoosh. And trust me, certain man weren't there. You yourself, on the real, what do you listen to? A bag of Mavado and Ross Clark. Basically, Alliance and Portmore Empire. Yeah. What about the Shibata rap side of things? Rap side, obviously, my dogs. Cool I don't know when I first met him because I met him before I can remember, bro. That's how long I've known him for. Me and this mate, each other, bro. It's not even like that. If I be real with you, man, I can't, bro. I'm saving the nursery to you, bro. Crazy, man. certain situations that not any and anybody would jump up to you get me to have to have my back yeah. in, you get what I'm trying to say to you. So yeah that's just that's just bro man. It's hard to speak on RA because of do you understand what I'm saying trying to say? Because of obviously um the realness behind his story. The dogs that rap That's what's in the fucking building RS Supposed to talk to reckless on my phone, I said I'm outside. All this in your back, and if you're dead, with your mouth wider. Couple of swimmers and two niggas, yeah, they outside. Supposed to they say rap war, coming through the back door. I'm dining off my clip, then my dog, he's a clap more. Both sides is old tray. Spoilers on my back, so nah, I ain't okay. SDR, this your boy SOS, yeah, you done long. Free the thumbs, you get me? Block five. Walk the walk. Yeah, my big bro, 
stars, come on. Yeah, you don't know them as R8. See when you're in the circle and your family the closest R dog. You get me? Yeah. Trust me, really Jenna. Real official. You get me? Yeah. When I first heard him spit, I was like, yeah. Donnie's official with this thing. But he knows what he's doing, you get me? And I said, yeah, I'm gonna follow them steps there, you get me? But you know, things happen, you get me? Just kind of slowed everything down. But yeah, my nigga's official, man. Trust me. Obviously, in the American side of things, the ghost, Uncle Murder. People are upset with your transition, you get me? You're getting into a different you. But what I'm saying is, people like me, we want to hear the crud. We love the crud from our age, from beginning till now, you get me? So I'm saying to you, what do you say to us fans that think, you know I'm, what? I'm saying Fuck rough. the transition, we want crud till the end. Yeah, crud till the end ain't making me more money. Yeah, but it makes it's us just, happy, boy. Yeah, but that's dead. <laughs> that's dead, bro. I can't just make everyone happy and I'm not getting no butter out of it. Don't yeah. Sense, it? Like, yeah. I've done the crud for years, bro. Yeah. I was 18. Crud ain't really making my money, bro. Yeah. It's just making me not get no bread, really. Yeah. Yeah. So I can't just be making people happy. Going to studio, making videos for the sake of it, just to like, keep a couple of men happy. Yeah, you got to get some, like, to get some money out of it, you get me? So, yeah. man, know that the crud's there, it's always in the bank, always in the tank, you get to you at any time, but certain times I'll just give you like a different side, you get me? It's yeah. Like, country, man's getting old as well, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, it's always got to cut you with it, and, but the crud's always there, the crud can never leave, you know, man. No one can ever disrespect my thing, it's your problem. You heard what the man said, I stopped wanting him in the block, skipping that crud. We're fucked because he's got a new <laughs> transition, you get me? That's my artist. Uh, yeah, that's my artist, man. I hate the artist regardless. Ever been on the field and seen your own niggas bled on you? How you bought it, bought it when them niggas stepped on you? Shit, I'd rather die. It should call the feds on you. You know we slide and buy if I'm putting breads on you. Life when I was about 30, 40, fucking, my family moved around the area where he was from, you get me? So I just used to be around there a lot. And then the first time I ever seen him, I seen him, like, we never had no interaction or anything. First time I ever seen him in person was outside a shop at Cold Harbor Lane called All Stars. Yeah, yeah. It's our local um, corner shop. It used to be in there like day and night. This is after I met him, you get me? Yeah. But yeah, fucking. First time I ever seen him was outside All Stars on Cold Harbor Lane. He back on someone, bro. You know what I mean? He just pushed it in someone's face, you get me? But I, was, I, I didn't freeze, but I was just looking at him. Oh, you get me? Yeah. I said, okay. And this went about my business, like nothing happened. But fucking, after that, I was just in the area a lot because my family moved around there. So one of the days, I don't know what I was doing. I was just in the area going about my business and he just pulled up in a white transit van. Started talking to me, saying, what am I doing? What have been up to? What, what, you get me? What am I keeping up? You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I said, no, I was just going about my business. He said, that I'm looking to put in work. I said, yeah. He said, jump in, you get me? <laughs> yeah. Back of the and uh, there was like three, four niggas in there already. Do you hear me? We went, went about our business, went to do whatever we had to do, and then came back. He dropped me off, and then we exchanged numbers, and then that was it. And then so he'll phone me, and I'll come to the block. I'll phone him, and then I'll come to the block and just chill out with him. And that's why I got to meet everyone, and then. Yeah, man, just went from I gotta give you like the story of the white fan. For years I used to fly past the block five and I was in the white fan. Different faces in the passenger seat on different days, you get me? But every time I drove past, I always used to nod out and be like, yeah, what are you not saying? You good? What are you saying? On the way to work. And he'd be like, yeah, say nothing, man's on the job. So I used to feel like, yeah, he ain't playing, you get me? He's got the white fan. I'm a decorator by trade and I ain't even got the white fan. But yeah, go on out. So then one day I come past the block. I must have seen about seven men flying out the fan. And there's not a paintbrush or roller in sight. Five was a deadly team on the five, had a dirty E, used to slide with the rest of peace. Four, five was a western piece on my life to remember me. Five. Five, five business. Five, like five business. Uh, only for epic thing. There's five blocks to this whole road. And if you know the name of the road, you know the name of the road. Pool up road. We're out in straight. One block, two block, three block, four block, five block, isn't it? So obviously you can't. You're just naming it now, isn't it? Block five. Bounty killer, man, still in black. Bang this wackle jackle, you think thrillers back. We the hardest.
that's still a south, that's still a fact. Big teeth in this dirty Harry, that's still a black. Everyone knows, yeah, RA's been hard from day. Listen. I never took a bad up in my life I was busting off my ting trying to catch him on a slide On a yard man ting the way I stab him with my knife I will push it in his stomach and I'm twisting out his tripe Man will risk it on the ice, crack his biscuit with a pipe Mac and cheese slap with ease, man will whip it from the fight Give him everything out of it then I'm dipping through the night Every prison that I've been in man will stick it on the guy You know, other story already Ah, uh, you know, that literally I can't even say no more You know, other story already it's Special politics in Jersey and that's like from a toddler, it's very special. Just the changes, the transitioning, and this is hygiene, the tidy, this is so tidy, extremely tidy, very tidy. When he came to his clothes, everything had to be immaculate. Don't give him anything to wear with materials. Uh, his shoes had to be polished. If his trainers had a scratch in it, he's not wearing it. Full stop. Five is real, wash and bubble. Poor people are gonna watch this and they're gonna be like, Rob, what's going on with DR this? He's always going on about RA, DRs, S West and riots. There were bare other spitters that spit fire. Yeah, there was. Man ain't gonna go away from the thing. There was definitely other fire spitters because every one of them put something on DR this TV before I was fucking hacked, you get me? So I'm gonna give you the list now and tell you how it goes down. Big Up, Images, Chronic, Levels, Kev, GI, Young Riots, you get me? Hits, RIP, Real Fire Spitter, you get me? And a couple of others that man might forget the names of, like the Batmans and his brother. If I ain't late, bro, it's a mad team, better just pray that the doctor's near. She said I don't show no love, can't busy like what she swear. Oh shit, I mean what's with circus. Stepped in the game with old bars, had new rap dogs getting all nervous And I didn't even do it on purpose That rap, the subtract, all on deal Before you to Yeah, that shit was fire Yeah, there's, there's, there's a lot, there's, there's, see what's mad? There's a, I feel like there's a lot of music Ardot's fans now Don't know of his Back in the days that they'll still be pumping till Ah, uh, of like, course, yeah but they didn't hear that kind of music They only heard of him from after he come out of jail and Yeah The music he's making now and that But they're yeah. not going back to listen to that kind of music You heard what the man said There's bare classics on the YouTube You need to type them in oh, 100 Yeah Get some of that rap this up, you get me? And learn something Jesus, cool, but every little thing is a test to beat my tool, I burn for your skin in the flesh I need the strip, I'll beat the stick They see police and snatch, I will release my stick Less my BMs, couldn't give peace to a chick Them way run when they see me and shit Ooh. like Pat I got bare eyes on me, but I ain't going out like a prick Cause my foes got a kick like Henri Donny is hands down the realest in the game You feel me? Uh, like, no biasing, you feel me? Even yeah. before, before I went with fucking with the man them, I was listening to Big Bro You feel me? So that's what it is Just the from cassava to block five We shoot faster with the block line We're on the glass of all of the time I held this prep free food and he started lying I better make him talk when I plug in the iron But back to the strip anytime I squeeze off They think I go to the shooting range Six days a week I'm busting my iron Make his mouth fly like a pilot Make his smell death in the air like a pilot dying Come to his block with the M18 and tear his block down like Private Ryan Fuck the hype, I'm down with Zion in the jungle Chilling with a tribe of lions Get a headshot like a life a giant Living your life with the lies of lion Hear what you need to do for me, big man. You need to promote that. Because you do your DJ and you've got your page. I need you to promote, big man. It's been up there two days and already it's looking at a thousand views. It spits on anything that's been put up this year by anyone from Roadside. Because he's the motherfucking hardest MC ever to come out of London. Ever to come out of Britain, Rubeway. Everybody's putting the comments again. Look at it. Hard. The hardest. Set RA3, he's the hardest out. Big man, he's still got four years to do in the thing. Even if they let him out after he does his whole time. And this is what he needs. He needs people to promote him so they know that he's still the hardest. And this, he can look at this in the prison and see what time it is. So yeah, big man, you best believe this is the return. Man's going nuts out here. But anyway, on another thing, when are you returning round mums with Ricky and his dad? Because the bag's fat, rude boy.
Mbare is about five years into his sentence and sometimes I feel like we forget that sentence was a 10 years IPP. You know, peak. Like you could do the old 10 and they're still not letting you out if you ain't coming correct. So anyway, I'm out here living life, innit? So I get into an altercation with security down at the Norwood Tesco's. One of them peak late night ones. So long story short, they're trying to give me a two. I'm thinking a two for this cunt. So anyway, I'm on the phone to R. He's like, yeah, what's good out there? I said, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. I got into a madness, big mum. Trying to give me a two out here, you get me? Leave mum on her own when she needs me. So he's like, all right, say nothing. So the next day now, I get a phone call. Solicitors telling me to meet him down at the coffee shop in Brixton. So I drop down there, you get me? I'm walking in the shop, I see my man in there suited and booted. So I'm like, yeah, what's good, big man? He's like, yeah, I'm here for art. I need to stipulate to you now, you get me? I don't play with these cases. Two years for a silliness down in Tesco's. A man like me deals with the murderers, you get me? The drug kingpins, the big boys. I don't play with these little ones, but due to our putting the word in, I'm here. So he said, your Donny there is different. So I ain't gonna lie, I looked at him and I thought, you know what? Everyone who meets him knows that big man, he comes different. So anyway, long story short, we go down to the fucking courthouse when it's time. Man gets acquitted. Blessings, you get me? Man's out here to tell another tell. So I tell Donny respect for that big man and then I say to him, listen, you know what time it is, R.A. Gardis TV and R.A. Real Artillery. What's good, big man? Out here, out here. Back in this thing, you get me? Back out here, fresh out of the pen. Obviously, uh, obviously everyone wants to know if man's really home, man really home, you get me? So, you know, like you said, look, pavement, you get me? Man's on the pavement now, you get me? Uh, so, man, no. Is what it is, and obviously so how you everyone, feeling? everyone don't have to panic as well. You get me? I'm not on the madman thing again. Straight music thing with the pushing this time. You get me? Yeah. Straight. How you feeling in yourself? I'm good, fam. Fresh, yeah. fresh like a, like I done a year. Uh, like I done ten. You get me? Calm. But obviously, they're saying the comebacks like the cartel was the boss case. You get me? So watch out for the mad thing. Yeah. When RA drops a new project, I have to hear that as early as fucking possible. Tiny, legendary no, no, RSGs. Tools, what are you doing here tonight? Yeah. You don't know where it is. Straight from the back of the curb and the sideline, is it? Big fists and ups and downs, big bitch busted down, big bro touch the ground. Got my cup, sussed it out, got the link, plucked it out. Big jump, fucked the back. Time, you get me? Man's been waiting for this shit for 20 years. Yeah. Argo, the hardest yeah. regardless. It's go time. Jim Brown, big man. Circumstance. Yeah. I slow this situation down. You get what I mean? But yo, iron's hot. Time for Jim Brown. When was the first time you heard some RA? How many years have you been ringing at it? Fucking hell, mate. Like when I was just starting, Jim Brown settings, R8, official artillery, you get me? Real uh, authentic. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Come on, man. Man, I put in work to get it. R8's new party, madness. Catch me on the album. No one yeah. is. Yeah, our tunes be country. Big tune. The whole album is like still. Baby, trust me, there's a couple of mad bangers on that thing. Trust me, trust me, trust me, trust me, trust me, trust me. Ah, look fire. Hey, yo, look, tag that drum, it's just what you're saying. 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 Hear what I'm saying? We're going to get into some old school. We're going to give you how this thing started, how the man's name started ringing on the road. What's going on, big man? Uh, well, let me take them back, big man. Let's forget about real artillery for a minute. Let's get into Razor. Let's talk about the young Razor, eight and nine, running around these parks here. Problem. 
the real little niggas that on this thing and they half my side to be Fuck on my clip and your cast people rise Corn that will turn you from young to old like stars in your eyes And with nine in your boat, you can see the star in your eyes Cause you're a five star loser, these times I'm a five star shooter Anytime all eight rise up a root Yeah like this park here, Con Park was a problem bro There was no goals on for a lot of people bro But obviously it was good times and bad times you know Yeah but, Razor, yeah, that, that, that was when it was a, a more of an issue than uh, Demi had no head them time then. Yeah. Problems. Let me tell them what I know about Razor, you get me? This time here, it was peak out here. It was a problem. Anyone coming around these parts, there was a team. Yeah. We ain't a team with a circle, it don't make sense. There ain't no point like a circle. The man that will steam and burst you. Talking about man like Dumpling, later known as Moss. I'm talking about Tio. I'm talking about Poser, the original Poser who changed his name obviously, we know who he is now, you get me? We're talking about White Boy Russell, who obviously, <laughs> you get me? White Boy Russell got a little couple licks through the way and he had to join another yeah, team out here. Russell was, was a fighter though, yeah. he was a fighter. Russell Tell us about it. them names. Yeah, like, that's foundation in the back, the man's freaking 10. Yeah. We're going back to like the man's 8, 9, 10, 11, yeah. old school, then yeah. foundation names in it, but obviously, a couple of men are still cool. Obviously, a lot of people move out of the area and go out somewhere else. So, yeah, yeah it's going to happen. But yeah, they were definitely fine. Yeah. And good with these fists, you get the man, they all punch up a lot of man still. Um, in the truth, I had a fight back in the day. I wasn't there to witness it, but you see the after effects, like in terms of. You know, when I've gone to Luke Arthur, you know, you know, troopers sitting down and they're both blood up again. So, uh, just from the look of it, you can tell that <laughs> like, it was a madness, you know. But uh, yeah, man, Arthur's good with it, man, trust me. Obviously, you're nine, you're ten, coming on to the bigger ages, you're seeing the area, you're seeing the bits around it, you've got mics filled. You got Angel Town, you got Summer Layton. Who do you see as a problem then time? Who's coming up in your era then time that you can say, you know what, he's about that? Um, all of the estates though. Yeah. All of the estates you named when we were gonna come up. It was all one anyway then time. Yeah. So it was one man of you each other. So yeah. It was all one, you used to go to everyone's estates and chill. When it was that time, man, it was still all like all the states used to just go to to one rate. Yeah, yeah man, just a sort of Brixton thing, you get me? Yeah. So yeah, like everyone was everyone was up. This one is just a little story of Josie about where he's coming from, you know. It's like you who travel lot, go to different countries and we've always want to install into them that other places in the world where people are not well off and they suffer and things. And Josie comes to all these places and he seems to fit in, you know, he to Jamaica. When he's young and when his friends and just go off, they always see him come back when he's hungry. You know, he goes on shop. The last set of times he's going to Jamaica by himself. Red car, go anywhere he wants to go. Because he knows these things, understand? So, these are the things what I'd like to tell you about Josie. Not just a one off guy, he's, he's a very, very travelled and I grew up on an art here, amazing artist. Always telling the truth, motivating us from the streets to try and find, you know what I'm saying? Stay motivated. All of the youth them on the block got their phones that play music and that. Yeah. Oh, them things went out before I went to jail. Yeah. yeah, so boom. And everyone's playing R A, R A W. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which is it's a legend. It's legendary. Bullets from the Mac 10. Oh gosh, you can't go nowhere without the bullets in the Mac 10, you hear me? It's R-A-W. Bullets from the <laughs> Mac 10 will smother you, like a bed sheet that will cover you. Ah. I've never been a prick or afraid of another you. I grip the gap that's, I grip the gap that's stainless, <laughs> bullet from the 4 5 leave you brainless. 4-5 to your head, you could die lameless. 3 five, seven is, I always scroll with ah. you. <laughs> I'm on the block performing, making peas, you're stalling. Yeah. Don't piss me off. RA, big up yourself. Look how much years ago we done. RAW, bullets from the. Broken niggas from broken homes with baseball bats and broken phones. Them man there just crying to the bone. Your daily always a chrome. Them man there are real to the bone. Break the rules and I break your nose. Blood to running from your broken nose. When we go to the old 20 mango. We say, this spot here, big man. Madness. I don't live in the hood no more, so that means I can put in more work than I 
tip of four, cause niggas used to know my block, I strip my door. Now I'm on the block with a clock, I'm tipping the four. I'm in the hood day. Block five, the pyro, the G block, them block A. I don't even come back cause I walk with a skeng. I've been back from way when I had four to the. It's like I tell the time when I walk with a skeng. Two hands on a nine, I keep it to ten. I'm a gong, I'm a super. I roll through in the swimming. Just giving out birds like man on chicken coops. I don't do no little man run ups, I run up in the bitches suit tonight, never scared. I don't keep my stick in boots, I keep it in my waist, brain to itch it. You shat. Tent man trips fucked up the game. They freestyles to watch now, you get me? What are they, 15, 20 years old? Yeah. The game is yours. I don't care what anyone said. If you like fire, the game was this. RA was the hardest grind spitter. Shaq Young was the hardest rapper. A lot of niggas talking, ain't murdering that, and I'm catching something up close, spinning some situations you've never dreamed. Let it scream, yeah. let him be talking like Rose with me. What the death mean, nigga? Fuck him, they ain't built like me. On my nuts, every sucker's looking shit for free. Pissed cause they see me on my dogs cutting little cheese. Nah, we don't need your help, my circle is tight. Every night I get the urge, I wanna take niggas like. Tent Man was bonkers, let's just put it straight. No one went fucking with the bonkers of Tent Man. And Trips, it was a madness. Yeah. Those four there, I don't care what you hear. Obviously, you had your devious, Mr. Lover Lover in the game, you get me? But other than that, these man had the game for South, and then you had gigs over there in Pekka doing these things, you get me? In my squad are great, my little shop in West End, that's my squad are great. Stepped in with a happy face, told him give me two pokes like a can of paint. Other music, certain man didn't listen to that. So let's go back, big man, and let's remind them, you get me? Let's remind them how that fucking fire come together. How did you four link up? All right, Parabellum, mad thing. Yeah. We got the artist TV as well, you know what's going on. Parabellum, don't know what oh. And the shell, shell, shell. We got R. A. of you, look, we got Parabellum, Mountain Man, Pet Man, this is the song of the Parabellum, that's all we got to say. Parabellum. Parabellum. We're bringing you back to where something mad happened. One night, obviously, I get the call. You get me? I was on the phone. I'm gassed. What are you saying? Where you at? I said, boy, I'm just down at Mum's. You get me? We get down to five now. So I come down to five. I'm telling you, no lies. It was chock a block. Because I'm walking in. I'm like, yeah, I'm nice around here. You get me? <laughs> Certain man ain't doing this journey. So anyway, as I got through all the goons, the rappers are there. You got S West, you got R, you got man like fucking riots. You get me? You got DRs, fresh on them, fresh on. Oh, See niggas in the God. box giving that date. Same nigga running with the cops, giving up names. And what this nigga got chased? How could a nigga want a nigga enslaved? Still be him on the block pitching that bass. Mm. Serving the rock, every hit I give ace. You heard how I flop. You kidding me, please? How could I flop when I get the piffest of cane? Mm. Pips on oh, the bitch, now nigga, shit. that's lame. Last girl I hit, still Exclusive. wishing my chain, still turning up late with the mega champagne. Mm. The flames, all these niggas got game. I was on to me in the entertainment centre. I bought him there the day before. And he hadn't really known me, you get me? So I'm all gassed when I'm doing my entertainment. You know how I am loud. So I'm in the in the entertainment centre down there. I was just sturdy, he's come with DRs. DRs is like, right, this is D. I'm like, what you said, big man? What you got for me? What, you need some of that entertainment? 
He's looking at me like, who's this Don here, get me? I'm going to have to stick it on him. And then I was like, nice, nah, calm, it's deep. And then from then, me and him's nice. So even when I came down here the next day, I could see DRs was looking a bit iffy at me, you get me? But he fired up them bars for him. So what I'm telling you, this night here was a madness. If you look on my channel and you go back through the history, you'll see the bars that were spat. RA killed it. Man like S West killed it. DRs killed it. You get me? And riots, young on the block. I'd never seen riots before. Fucking fight. Niggas wanna talk on the greed, but you don't wanna ride with the artist G's. My niggas will kill, but kill for the G's. Yeah, when it comes to beef, you niggas will breeze. And I won't hesitate to draw for the pumpy. Make you fool like Humpty Dumpty. You don't wanna beef you. Man's up pricks, I ride your block and squeeze your mungy. There's an ego, my team for real. I got that shank, that stain is still. It's hard to live, but ease to kill. I catch you slipping, then bust at your face. Blood leaking, it's a blood beacon. I fuck the rest, yet it's blood season. And when I tell you fight, like I said to you, I come up on nothing else but Styles P. So I don't want to listen to no joke dogs talking about their fire. This block made me understand. What happens in the dark will come out in the light, you get me? And that's what we saw. What happens in the dark comes out in the light, but then I got to put the body in the casket. Bring back the memories of that night when you fired it yeah, out. Even like, like I said, it? when we pulled up, it was emotional for me. Yeah. I remember it, you get me? All the G's there. Free all the bros that are still having jobs. Yeah. Yeah, all the bros that are out there. And at that time, I knew it was summer as well. Yeah. So it was nice out there. About 100 men out there. It was a madness. Was you didn't want to walk past here if you didn't know RA, you get me? Because one of them might have been on you. <laughs> but I'm going to give it to you real big, man. I feel like you don't understand what you've done. Like it's a madness. What you was doing back then, no team wasn't like that. I don't care what they say on interviews with Donnies that ain't got no balls. When you had this block going buck wild, everyone was fire or they better fuck off. Yeah, you of get the other teams that, yeah, certain man was hard. They had that area, but everyone on the team weren't hard. Get it straight. This team was hard. What, what do you say now when you know that you done that? If you come on this block and you ain't spitting fire, you ain't getting hurt. Best listen up, you're rolling with the G's. My goons will stick you up if you're holding them with keys. My youngers hit you up and they're only 16, like EST, they're on it because they're rolling with me. But let's get back to the roads and the beef. But the beef gets deep like a hole in your teeth. teeth. And I heard you said, we were just laughing, let them jump in the beef. I ain't gonna ask them. I just ride out hard body with a start. I draw the fire arm, get the fire, fire in, so the fireman get done for arson. Awesome. Them niggas are lying, so someone's gonna blast. You did that. Yeah, that yeah. can't be took. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. So how do you feel when the, the people that really know, they know that? Yeah, you know what it is? Like, obviously, this this was the HQ, it? Yeah. This is where it all started, innit? So, and they know that, like, yeah. You know about pain, trapped in your head Make sure you listen, I'll clock what I said Driving your car with a lot on your head Then the ops just pull up and empty the lead You didn't get touched, you weren't meant to dead My brother got 30, it went to my head After reading these letters, I went to my bed All men's little girls and the spitters around man. They knew they had to come strong Yeah Or it's long Yeah To represent something big like you know Yeah Yeah bro, so like, I feel good that like you know I brought, I brought up some fire spitters Yeah when did you get a feel to the fact that RA was the hardest regardless? You get me? Uh, what from, 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 from a known heart, from a known heart, he's <laughs> been the hardest. What are you talking about? <laughs> from a known my brother, he's been the hardest. Yeah, Josie, for people who don't know, you know, you've got your own perception of him. But for people who do know him, you'll know that he's one of the kindest youths you will ever meet. I'm going to tell you one thing, and this is a quick thing. I used to travel regularly and I went to America on a boat, an English jacket. I don't know if people these days know what that was, but back in the day, it was the jacket for us. Nice little leather jacket, earbreaks. Original. Brought it back, gave it to Jose, loved the jacket. After about two months, I asked him, where is the jacket? Oh, you know that I gave it to my friend because he knew that I'd like to wear it. And I'm saying, you know, it's, it, we take it as a joke, but from them days, Jose's been this kind of guy who would help. 
anyone. And you know the magical thing about it? He never wants praise his good. You know, he don't even want people to know that he's done it. You know, that's just the kind of guy he is. My man down with a pencil, best I broke my record One of these checks, he turned for the petrol I ain't think about mental, mind of your whip Cause niggas are dreadful If your pension sinks, you want to cut that link Could be get your head I wanna ask you one thing that people are saying out there I've seen a good few things So I wanna ask you Are we getting another combo, big man? People wanna know about the combo It was left hanging Um, you know what? Combo? I wanna give another combo But I just feel like it might have, like it might have run its course in it. Yeah. I need to give you something else now. Get me about the next thing called um is it exclusive word about the next thing called the Chino score. Yeah. That's a different drip, get me? It's like still like the really like, like a um, story kind of thing. Kinda of like the combo, but it's a different kind of spill. written and everything already is romantic, get me? So yeah. I'm thinking I might give you that first and see how that goes, you know what I'm saying? But combo yeah. seems a bit outdated now, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, for just those of us that were feeling it though, I ain't gonna lie big man, you never done everyone dirty like they should do, that's why maybe we seem one of one more, you get me? When RA just shells up the game and leaves it come, yeah, yeah, you get yeah, me? Yeah, yeah. I, might, I might just do a mazzoline still, I might just bring it back, just for the hardest team. Uh, obviously I've done some insights of before I had the pleasure, and I'm saying out here, like, I'm gonna tell you the first thing I ever heard on RA. You know, I was giving the streets, let's say, I was giving them entertainment and there was some young youths in there and obviously I'm fresh on this bit here, you get me? So there's some young youths have come over to me to buy some, some entertainment. Then they're telling me, bruh, look who that is coming along the road. So I'm looking out now and they're like, bruh, that's oh, He's a problem, Randy. So like, I'm like, bruh, say no more. I'm all right, I'm gone after this here, you get me? <laughs> But then obviously, as time goes by, I had the blessings of there you are, standing in front of the entertainment, you get me? I'm like, rah, say nothing, the real dog. So I'm saying, I heard what was going on out here. I'm hearing, listen, this guy here, he don't play. He's got the long things, and they're getting your face if you go wrong, you get me? So they have to understand, this game ain't no joke. They watch these rappers, everyone's bad. But I'm saying, the thing was serious, you get me? I'm not at it to gas no one up. I know what time it was. Block five, and even before that, it was a madness out here. So when you look back now and you say, you know what, the game's dead. There's people doing silly shit to pretend there's something. You was a serious error, and it was a madness. What do you think now when you come around these bits and you think what it was then and what it is now? He was on it, but he shut his mark before I came. I've been on it since click suits and leans with the fades. Long before I was 13, I was mean with the blade, and then I got mean with the eight, and then I got mean with the nine and the MAC. I put an E and D to your life. Yeah, it's all a shambles now, isn't it? Like you said, isn't it? everyone, everyone switches it up. Yeah. And everyone grows up, and a new generation comes in. And yeah. So it's never going to be the same again. So yeah, that's just what it is now. This era is just on a different thing again. So. Yeah. But I'm going to say again. The RA I knew, you couldn't chat to him. Music, no music. I remember, you couldn't chat to him. I don't want no one coming up to me like, oh, I know you remember me from school days. We were running red on the streets, like, fuck that. All that's dead on the streets. Yeah. Neeky dickheads begging for beats. Then you got these clowns that's begging for beef. Chop him up in his house and throw his head on the streets. I remember you used to come and bless me down in my other entertainment place, down near Mummy's. I'm going to give it to him. You get me enough, man, no, anyway. And when you walk through that door, Bear man shook. And these ain't no joke dons, these are man that are on road. They're getting paid. They see you walk through my mums and they're like, Wah. you don't chat to no one. You do your thing and you're gone. This is the thing you add on road. I remember a man used to say to me, Wah. that's all right. I'm grinning. I know that's all right, you get me? He's coming through my piece. What are you not saying? Nothing. But I'm saying certain man that were official knew they couldn't chat to you. Now you're doing this music thing, big man. It's like people can chat to you. I know it's a music thing, you're trying to do your thing, get paid. But how do you feel when you think back then, them man couldn't chat to you, and now they're chatting to you like they're nice? Who's chatting to you? Just anyone who, back in the day, you couldn't chat to R like that. You yeah, get me? You couldn't speak yeah, to him even on a level. Anyway, no, not in a bad way. I'm yeah. saying like now they're, 
they're yeah, around yeah. to get yeah, me yeah, they're yeah. friendly they're nice yeah, they yeah. can chat to you it's, like that's what i said now it's like it's a different era and back then man was more on the road team than the music yeah anything. so that's always gonna come first yeah any form of like something that don't look right i'm all over it you know? yeah that's because man was fully like into the road then friend it was about oh five no might have been all six or all seven i think i was about 16 17 you get me me and three of us went and we had a quick move to go and and and, and manage fucking we went and dealt with it obviously ours ours was the what was was, was he, he he was a big gun you get me it was big bro so he had all rights to like take more than anyone else and no one could really say anything you get me but he did it. He split everything down the middle with whoever was there. And we I was about, about 16, 17 and we and and there was me, him and another fellow, so there was three of us and then he cut everything down the middle and I walked away around seventeen. We all walked away near enough over a hundred. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. And, and, and since then, that's when I personally, I don't really know about anyone else, but like, that, that confirmed to me that like, he, he, was, he was a real deal, you get me? Yeah, man didn't take nothing extra, kept it real with his brothers, yeah. And not only that, he popped hell of an off, you get me? Man yeah. doesn't even have got popped off, you know what I mean, bro? And that's He's coming saying. from me, I'll straight. Yeah, sharing out to Donnies that didn't even put in a work, yeah. Now, obviously, man still got their wits in it, but man's grown now, isn't it? Man, man have to make sense of it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, nowadays, um, man's in the music thing, fully, yeah. and on the road, you know what I'm saying? So now, you have to make way for certain clowns, you know what I'm saying? No one's ever going to violate you, yeah. or disrespect you, or man. but like you said, in it, man get the, the opportunity to stand in front of you, you know what I'm Yeah. When before, man could do that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But do you ever sit down and think, right, oh, you know what, I don't even really want this man around me? Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. Come around and just feel like it's, it's, it's a joke to us. Only because we're doing music or we're in an entertainment world. Yeah. That, that can't even happen with them. But otherwise, it is what it is. As long as you're not riding in space or any other people around me or anything like that, then we're good together. One day, the scene will be comparing about something with regard to Jersey. I went to St. Paul now and I asked him about it. And he told me what it was. And then at the end of it, he said, But mom, who was I supposed to be broken? And I said, Got me thinking. Yeah. Who was I supposed to be broken? We were on, on top of FM together, like, they, um, I think their show was. Before mine, yeah. Um, on a Wednesday, I'm sure it was. I can't remember the timing, and that I'll be lying if I told you the timing. Yeah. But you know, we've we've always been tight like that, brother. He's always been the hardest, bro. Yeah. And he's always been truthful to the things that he says. Ah. Uh, you know, it's all right. It's all right. It's all right to say a man's great. At, um, you know, what I mean, spitting bars or yeah, he's a wicked he's a spitter or whatever. Yeah. Bro, if, is he? If he's not true to the things that he says, bro, yeah, then he's not. And I'm honest. Yeah, and the and the, the road can't relate to it, bro. How are you the hardest, bro? The hardest is only the people that you know, you know, that that push out the work yeah. that the community can relate to that. Yeah. Why? Because we remember you when you was around us. It was exactly that. Yeah. You know what uh, I mean? We got our head anyway, yeah, bread out for life. People get twisted when I spit more time, man just spit in their past, innit? Yeah. And what I've been through and like that's man's life, that's what man knew. So obviously I'm just giving you my past it's for entertainment, innit? But then obviously I might give you an insight to the real life shit as well, you get me? Yeah. Just mix and blend it, you get me? I don't mean I'm being a hypocrite, but the reality of it is just entertainment, but the youths them wrote in blood. So that's all sweet choice. When I'm bad, man. He's running up his mouth with his only nine Like my father, we don't borrow, we only buy Get bowled up with the hollows and slowly die Listen, I don't care who you part with fam To drop him, they wanna know how fast I can That's how fast it bangs Welcome, that's how hard it bangs I'm in a garrison with the hardest hang Roadside, see a the largest gang When he done his head show thing Headline show 
I said, I'm happy for you, man. Like, this is what we need. You out there, you done laid the foundation. You should be out here with certain people that are already up there and established. Yeah. You part of that circle, part of that generation, you done your shit. Yeah. You should be out there. There's many people that wouldn't want to see RA where he is right now. Yeah, cool. The same way there's many people that wouldn't want to see me where I'm yeah. right now. But yeah. brother, you have to want to see yourself where you are. That's why you are where you are. Since he come out, come out, he's been doing doing a lot of a lot of positive things, and you know what I mean, yeah. like keeping himself out of trouble, and you get me. And at the same time, he's trying to, as much as art he makes that the kind of music he makes. At the same time, if you really check his angle, you know, he's trying to be an inspiration to anyone that comes from. You understand the, the, the beginnings that he come from. Yeah. You understand the lifestyle that he once lived. I showed everyone that yo, there's a way out. Yeah. You get me? And you get me? So we to hire you for that. My guy. Step back for Ari's headline show. They got the hardest TV. You know what it's hustle clothing in the cut. If you don't know, get to know. You know what it is. Oh, oh, man. Man. oh two settings. I know. Yeah. yeah. Shut it. Shut it. Shut it. Ah, you know what it is. Block five. Broken niggas from broken homes. Back from broken phones. Step out there and spread the blood. Rush in it. All in the front. Ra. You know what I'm saying? Mr. Drip. Drip London. You ready now? Come on. Come on. Now I drip the hardest TV. Ah, oh, it's the turn. Oh, two. Shut down the hardest TV. On the streets, watch your head back. When you get all the talking out of the knee, I'm gonna stretch that. You know where my men's at. The knees where my head's at. Free all my get backs. I see it when you get back. It's a cheat, I don't catch up. I have been waiting patiently. Patiently. The soul may want to see how it's going, but it's supposed to check too much. Oh, no, shut down. Trust me. I'm watching the channel, man. Let's go. What's the talking about? I'm leaving. Then I find myself going back trying to get out with the captain of Eden. Oh, he's so heavy. What are you saying? I had a night for you in there. It's crazy. It's crazy. Brought me back. You get me? Look at that trick. Night. Block five. You need to understand, yeah. There's families out there that suffer, that they ain't done nothing to no one. Mums and dads that pass away while man's sitting in jail. Sisters and brothers that get things happen to them. You can't do shit to help them. You get me? Let alone the travelling, family, mum, dad, aunts, sisters, brothers, miles on miles to try and come and see you and keep it real. Because the Donnies you thought were going to do it ain't doing shit. So I'm telling you, learn to look after your family and stay the fuck at home. Because there ain't nothing out here but the fucking cage or the grave. For a name, a name that sooner or later is forgotten. Just be real to yours. Like when you're doing this journey now and still they recognize RA, do you feel in any way that they don't really recognize the fight? I'm like, everything I spat was my past and my eye was on. 30 in this maxi, the sparks, know the fire's long. Bro pulled up mid drill, told him fire on. You got the left, cover the right, that's how you ride along. Nine along, find a boy skin that I'm driving on. Drive past another up block, might just sign it on. Send a fat pussy gal around, get a spying on. All these rappers cap rap, brother, why you? Lying down. They're not spitting on the five like you man was, let's be real. And the people ain't recognizing what the five was. How does that go down with you? You know what? Now it's calm, man. Now I'm calm because obviously man's grown, isn't it? Yeah. I've got other things to worry about now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Before, man was a, like an official field marshal. Yeah. So everything was broad government. <laughs> yeah. Now, um, man's grown, man's gone through some crazy shit that we yeah. couldn't think. Um, a man's living to tell the tell you then. Yeah. So obviously now, them little things don't work. I don't like care what people think about it like that. Oh, yeah. Man, if I didn't get recognition. Yeah. Is what it is. Man's still here. Yeah. Still the representative of it. 
people know what time it is. It is what it is. Yeah. You know? When you come out of them cells after hitting the tent and you first come on the block and you know like Let's be real, rights is in jail. I'll be on the white lines, running with the action. You be on the sideline, watching and clapping. Yapping your gums and I aim and slap them. Pull up on the bike with a gun on my right and I aim for the sides with your mind in sight. Let's play for the night, let's play this song. There's a price in your life, now your life is gone. DRs is in yeah, jail. No, one's spitting. no, no one, one ain't yeah, spitting yeah. that fire and no one ain't trying to keep that fire of light. You get me? Mm. But that, that, How did that feel to you? That's calm because obviously that's what, that's what it is. And not. Um, not everyone's built for it. Yeah. Not everyone's built for having that fire. Some yeah. might spit skippy, some might like spit like different. You get me? Yeah. But to have that fire, that's got to be in your, in, embedded in your bones. You know what I mean? Yeah. Things. And a lot of men just might not have had that. They might have just gone a different route of rap or yeah. the music scene. So, me even thinking about that, it was just like it's light in it. Like, yeah. There's never going to be a generation like man's. Nah. That's just how it is. And not when it comes to fire. Yeah, there's never. Yeah. And, in, in, and in other things as well. Yeah. That yeah, generation yeah. is past. Mm. Now it's time for the new generation. It's their yeah. time, they're doing their thing. But man's thing was separate. Yeah. No one could deny it. You know what I'm saying? Anyone who knows the game knows this is the spot where you've done the legendary plain clothes. You get me? You and RA shot by the locks let me ask you first what was your first association with ra how did you meet him well i don't my brother in it um well i grew up with our his older brother from when we were little kids ah uh, so ours must have been mad young then yeah like we're talking about i've known um the older brother since i was going primary school and that so um first time i met our is when i came came home 2005 when i came home 2005 um chance came to um chance's yard yeah yeah because chance was kept telling me say yo you have to meet you have to meet my local brother you have to meet my local brother come with me this is block five you see what them bushes eh? Turn about them bushes. Man. See them bushes, eh? And them bushes, eh? And we're up there. And them bushes, eh? This is block five. Yeah, this is block five, look, that's block four. You would say that's that's another block, yeah? That's one other block. If you walk down there, you see block three and it goes so and so. Yeah, map it out. This is where a whole heap of fuckery is going down still. But that's for next time, innit? Not for me to talk for, for other people. I don't do this. Come on. I'm just giving you a quick talk. A lot of people talk about birth for the newer kind. What exactly was that? Huh? They say RA, he gave birth to the newer kind. I gave birth to the newest kind. What's he gave birth? He gave fucking life, he gave everything. And you're just wasn't even just for block five, you're just wasn't even for the road side. You're just wasn't even for the road side. You just wasn't even just for block five, it just wasn't even for the road side. He gave birth to a lot of surrounding in the southwest regions. You know what I mean? Even on the southeast, they can go out like they, they won't admit it, but they will. The first time I met ours was actually in yeah in Shanty's house, and um, obviously I've heard about him from his from his a kid. I've yeah. always heard about this wild kid, but um, yeah, so I met him and yeah from there from there it's just his it's history from that. You get me? <laughs> yeah, that's bro. All right, so let me ask you, big man, when was the first time you knew he could spit and he could spit fire? Why? You have to understand, you see at that time, yeah. um, I feel like um, RA and Gigs were just mashing up the place. Yeah. Because all of the youth them had 
if they weren't playing RA, they were playing gigs. Yeah. If they weren't playing gigs, they were playing RA. Yeah. So really and truly, yeah. At them time, they, it, it was just very evident that obviously, yeah. He's got it. Yeah, he's got it. Ah. Uh, yeah. So let me ask you this, big man. How did the tune come together? Like I'm telling a plain clothes, legendary tune. Still to this day, people want to play that on the YouTube. It's fire. Yeah. How did that come together? Well, without making no one feel no kind of way. Yeah, because obviously, you know what I mean? Everybody's grown now. Yeah. You get me? But I had a grievance with somebody. You get me? I ain't trying to call no one out. Yeah. So that's how the tune really came about. And and it was it was a no-brainer because of the pace of the tune and the, um, the aggression that was in the tune for me to make the tune with R.A. Yeah. So R.A. never, never they put that out there, R.A. never had no problem with this person or nothing. It was really me pushing that agenda and I just featured my brother on it because, yeah. how, because the tune was hard, innit? No matter where you get it was coming from. But like you're telling us, the tune was hard. We yeah. all know that. But did you know how hard that was going to be and how much of a legendary tune for the hood that was going to be. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. Me and I, if, if we, yeah, we, we fucked that tune up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah we Real fucked it too. up. Yeah. 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 Cause run when the riders is out Cause they know that the guns with the splice is out Drop a body, mom's crying, what they crying about? This is everyday living, niggas dying to stop We came out of jail, starched up, we ironed them out We show niggas what I had about And if there's anybody other than fan They think they lie, come see me I'll show you what I'm dying about I'm on some uncle murder shit Don't pack the mash if you ain't down to murder shit Burn the nigga with the burner, the burn the whip Hustle's some zeds on a daily to earn a grip Hustle's some star on a daily to earn a pitch You might catch me up in the ring of whip With the ring of stick When I ride, never ring a prick, man Niggas on the ride, but never ring a stick Let's start with the locks, because the locks ain't getting these flowers, you get me? Yeah. There was a locks out here before there was ever a SBTV, ever yeah. a Grime Daily and ever a Link Up. Yeah. Tell us about locks, what's good with the locks? That's big bro man, that's a big bro. Yeah. You get me, Rude Locks. Um, Rude Locks is someone that's known me since I was a, since, since a little pissing tail boy, he known me since I was a kid, oh. you get me? So. Um, yeah, he just obviously he seen that the man them's doing their thing and that and to you get me as as you man that he's watched grow and them something. Yeah. He just you know what I mean? Um kinda invested invested his time and energy into the man them and that's how that video came about still. Yeah. So yeah, Rude Locks definitely, you get me, that's big bro, hundred yeah. percent. Back to when you've moved on now, obviously you've got the name RA, you get me, R Dot. The roads are going nuts. Give us a proper insight to what made you bust that first tune. You get me, what made you do the broken homes? Like obviously you've said about your past, but you know that tune just went buck wild. I don't think people understand. People were on buses on their Nokia, people were in the roads, the YouTube weren't built like it is now. But the thing spread through the blocks and estates all over London. What did you really make you do that and what did you feel when it was getting about? Yeah, it was calm, it was calm man. Um, when they heard that, when they heard that, that that whole broken, that was the first time people come out with that. That kind of slow. Then, yeah. Obviously a lot of men could relate to it, that's what we're coming from. Yeah. That side of the water, so it was calm and garbage, you know. So, I, I, I understood that everyone's gonna feel it regardless. Yeah. I didn't know it was gonna go mad though. That yeah. was when people started saying, "Yo, man, I spit the game." Yeah. I said, "It's something up that makes sense." Of it. Obviously, this bit round here, around it, there's a lot of people that are official with your team. Like, obviously, you grew in the ends. You started meeting certain man. It started to grow. Let's get into the roadside G's before it was roadside G's when it was darker. You get me? Let's talk about that, Too Dark, yeah. Man like Smiley originated it, you showed me in the past, yeah. I've been the lost piece to the puzzle, the link that's missing. Where I'm from, you pay five grand, a body goes missing. Even though doing time weren't part of the mission, I adapt to any habit and yeah. play my position. Smiley. Stuck on the grind like a locked transmission with the food for canteen or cooking whites in the kitchen. I rip the road like a brand new religion. What the fuck do you really expect? I'm a villain. Tell me now, I'm hearing 
that at first, certain man was thinking you wasn't built for the team. Like you didn't have bars. Like all of a sudden they're thinking, right, I ain't got no bars. Then you give them some, but like that though. But man, that's for, because I never used to spit around. Yeah. Long the day, so no one didn't know like, right, I, had, I was spitting. Yeah. I was just fully on this road thing. Yeah. But it was only when man them had a radio, pirate radio, and I said, yeah. Rolling through. Yeah. I was like, man was confused, like, what? You're rolling through. I was like, yeah, man's on this. Shh, come. Yeah. Gone radio. Man didn't know what they were going to expect, innit? Yeah. And then obviously, when I grabbed the mic and done my thing, the man was confused, like, why? They didn't know that you're here, so. Yeah. So that was how that went too. From school, people knew who our yeah. was. So, you know what I mean? This is what it is. Man, them stay true to their self and just keep true to the craft. And, and and just keep getting the flowers. And man yeah. should be getting their flowers now. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, man, I'm gonna forget their flowers, man, because I wanna put in the work. All right, so let me get into that now. Obviously, that starts rolling. Like, why did you not change it from Too Dark? What's what's going on with that? Why did it change? You know what it is? Time? I don't even know, you know? But nah. with Too Dark, that was before, way before my time as well. That was like, when you had Gideon, Vex. Yeah. Um, and that was like Smiley, original X and Smiley, then them, Elf yeah. and, and Diggers, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Them plans that I wasn't even on it like that, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that was way before my time. Um, yeah. Then when it came into my era where I'm like kicking balls with the older right now, yeah. um, it was just roadside. So when Smiley, I'm not, you know what it is, it came out of the garage scene, so it was the garage, that whole garage. Then when it came into the real kind of grime kind of thing, yeah. the man had switched it in, a couple of men parted their ways with the two dark. Yeah. And then Smiley changed it and, and made it roadside, that was it. Yeah. Okay, well let me give them what I remember on roadside. Like, I'm gonna tell you like this as fact. I never fucked with no English music. Styles P, Sheep Nooch, Jay the Kiss, and Jay Hood. That's what I was running these streets with. Yeah, I was selling the dip sets and the fucking little wains and that, but I can't play that. And then I'm hearing this guy here's got this fire. So I'm like, hold on, there's actually English music that can fuck with a style P. Yeah, so I'm going on this R dot mission, you get me? I want to hear more of R dot. Because I don't fight or scrap, I like and clap a prick in his face if he hypes on man out. Violate man, I'm a bad boy, that's why I bag a man out here, hide from man And it's really cool. got to the stage, yeah. I could've known man from a long time I would still ride on man, right. with a long nine, if you move sideways fam You started fucking up the streets hard Your team was going bonkers You had the tune out there that everyone knows Don't come down to the roadside You had tunes like One Step Closer Get that dough Get that dough, Get that dough. Invest in food and buy sticks like five in a row don't get robbed or let that go, I'm getting dough If you got fuel, I bet the nine will make you let it go You're not repping though Came in your block, run up and you just froze and let it go My niggas are real, we'll get that dough Collect the dough, never ever let that go Shop B and A class and let that flow Add buy cars and add some extra O's for extra dough These niggas don't rep the roads So hustle hard and get that dough Try to run up on my shit, I'll let that go Bang, bang. My life is real, your life's more to a joke Yeah, to get that dough That was fire as well when I heard that, I said, yeah, that was fire still, trust me. Yeah, that was the shout still. Hell of niggas turned up for that one day. You get me? Yeah. Them, the, so that was the days where man was wearing them stop snitching t-shirts. Yeah. There was a lot of snitches. Man was exposing them at, man start wearing the t-shirt, stop snitching. I remember them days there. You get me? It was going berserk. So I'm going to ask you on the real big man. You've come out of jail now. Like obviously you've made it clear that obviously they've set things on you that you can't do tunes with certain men. But you've been out a minute now, big man. Like what is it now? Is they still putting that on you? Because I ain't gonna lie to you, the people are thinking like what? You and the roadside ain't all nice. Like why is there no tunes with all the man them on? It's three, four years now you've been on road. Yeah, but obviously my sentence was 10 years. Yeah, so yeah. You think of it, three, four years, nothing can it? Yeah. Really, I mean, that's my license. So they're not lighting up on you no, like, right, it's still, music, you can yeah, do things. A, yeah, it's still a bit, um, still a bit fun. Again, obviously, man could probably, if man was to, like, stress it, stress it. Yeah. Man could probably, you get me? But it's not that deep, man. Yeah. Everyone's not, like, certain man's not the music. 
So I'm gonna ask you, like, when did you know from your spitting that you was able to stand up there with RA, S West and DRs, you get me? What made you know, listen, I can spit fire like them, man? You know what it was? Because there was just truth behind the bars, wasn't it? So when you're speaking the truth, you just, you're gonna gravitate to people that's actually speaking the truth and you're yeah. gonna, you're not gonna, you're gonna connect and it's gonna come out real no matter what. Niggas try and call blossom when they was frosting, when the brain gets shot, when these boys are Austin, but I stay in the shape. Yeah, yeah, this young don's nice. Man, we that will last for a bit, but I run up in the home, put a hole in your wig. I ain't chatting no shit, but I'm telling you. It's a different generation now, their man ain't spitting fire and it hurts. Smiley, Elms, Diggers, DRs, they all got fire still. You know yourself that they they still got it. Everyone's on different parts. I've seen things like that before. Everyone's on different parts. Everyone's on different things. Yeah. Some people's on different areas, different scenes. Like, yeah, yeah. Some man with a spit here and there, here and there, but a lot of man ain't taking it seriously. Yeah. But us on the outside, we would say, you know what? We want one banger for remembering what you man was. The real ones that don't care about views, they don't care about following, they care about what the roadside G's done for this game. This, this is an important moment, everyone to remember. You can't always get what you want. Yeah, real talk, yeah. That's just it, like, there's, it's deeper than certain things. Like, it's deeper than music in certain areas. Yeah. It's, it's deeper than things that man can speak about. Yeah. In certain things. Not not, not to say that's, that's what's going on with the man then, but I'm saying sometimes things can be deeper, so people just got to understand if it's not happening, it's not happening for a reason. It's the five, bro, man, built this, bro. Yeah. Back up. This is man's block, from all the way down there, all the way up here. These are like patrolling quarters, you get me? Yeah. I need to patrol this. Step round, you get me? But it's mad to know what coming around, bro. It's long. It's <laughs> long for them, them times there, you get me? So that's what I would ask you as well. Twice the man might have come round, but it was it was light. They realised that it's just, it's just a bit. Yeah. Don't even outside, bro. In the middle of the streets, cracking people's head off. But when we were like 12 and that, bro, outside, when a lot of man was inside, still. That's how I could like vouch for you, feel me? Only if I have it, bro, I know these pups. You know what I'm saying? These pups are my family. has been close. It's been a lot for years, bro. How did you first meet Shaq, first meet Temp Man, and first meet Trips? Shaq obviously grew up in it, like the same man. Yeah. Obviously, look at the school as well. That's a pretty good move, Charles. So, I'm just a natural move. Yeah. Tenth yeah. man, same in it. Young yeah. buck. It's a wild move. Yeah. It's about the garbage then. So, that was it. And yeah. the trips, obviously, trips do. Just trips used to be just on the other side of the block. Yeah. It's all one in it. Everyone grew up, like they grew up in the end. Yeah. It weren't like a put together thing. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, this was like a yeah. man grew up on the end. The man has done real things all together. And it just so happened to spit. Yeah. So it's natural. But what was the first time you all knew each other could spit and spit fire? Like, where was you when you were at first heard Shaq? When he first knew you had that? I don't know, but I first heard Shaq like on, on, on the PDC thing. PDC first. Done their first video. Yeah. Future. That's my first movie to spit. Yeah. It was cut down the road. Yeah. Trips. Temple. I don't know how I first heard Temple. Temple used to be with my mom from back in the day. Yeah. And he used to spit with my life. Gary yeah. and Tim there. Yeah. So I knew Temple to spit. Yeah. Trips. Trips just from the pit when they used to the peak of the fifty. Yeah. I heard it on the radio as well. Trips was a spit with the music brand. Yeah. On top of it again. Whether hardest, regardless of what they think. Pop the captain and sit back and watch their whole shit sink. Cause they've been talking for a minute like they do this thing. When they ain't even putting in work right. My doggy with Gavel will leave your brains on the curbside. Night a day, then things come out. Right away. When you saved me from a mad night with Ten Man, you must remember we was at um, Ham's memorial and Ten Man wanted to get in my car talking about drop me up the road. <laughs> Do you remember? And he was like, Ruba, you guys nuts. Leave the artist. And he was like, Ten Man, no, just wreck out the road. 
And this time he was on these bunk and shit. You get me? That could have been a peak out of the road. But you saved me from that one. What a crazy outcome. Oh. I was fucked, niggas up. I ill age. Two up with no age. Don't want it. I got a gun that will tear up your whole body. Mm -hmm. And all the niggas that I know is on the roads on it. You better off not coming round here. It's Brixton, 28's running round here. Yeah. Black town map when I'm coming out there. And I wanted to remind you how hard I was dealing with this channel back then because right about now, I never knew Ten Man. I never knew Shaq. This time here, I'm getting calls from R to say, listen. I'm with Temp Man, I'm with Shaq. This time I'm flying onto different blocks and them man's just sitting there, ready to give some fire, you get me? That's how the game was. Man didn't care about how many followers, how many views, it's real. If you're out here, you're trying to do something, man was helping you back now. So that's what I gotta say to the people that don't know the history. And right now I'm telling you this, for this area, around these areas, it was my chameleon. He was the man who was fucking up the game back then. But I had this block. He never had this block. He knows that full well, you get me? I'm with R, so he won't come in my here. But he had the rest of the South, I'll give him that. Say no more. Shout out, Michael Williams. Man go way back with R's bro, way before the music thing. Way before everything was all this gang gang up up thing, you get me? Knee high thing. But obviously, naturally, ours is a few years older than my thing, so naturally, that's big, bro. You get me? Always showed on by love. You get me? Obviously, Tony's been about his thing from the get go, from the jump. Day one. You get me? Old school, you no, know, back in the day. Come up days, we buy. In front of ours, ours just swerve around, you get me? Yeah. Pattern whatever I need to pattern that. Yeah. That's all ours, bro. Wrap up. Yeah, this year. Not how much shellings, you know, I think it's wrap up to more three games in the Yeah. Give us some of the hot topics that's coming in this one. Like, Everything we know a lot's happened. Of it, like, Russia, and Ukraine war. Yeah. We've got flipping, um, flipping the politics, the prime minister issues. Yeah. The gang shit just popping up out there. Be a rapper with Bane, be a bear situation, you get me? A lot yeah. of topics going on. A couple of months. Yeah, we definitely want to hear something about that one week Prime Minister, you get me? That's a yeah. madness for the game. <laughs> Yeah, so let's get on to something else, big man. Obviously, we're all looking for that wrap up. It's been coming. This is about the fourth one, if I'm right. Yeah. So let me ask you now, rap man. Obviously, he started the thing. You and him are nice. He's been in the combo. You've been in other bits with him. What's he saying? How do you two get on with that now? Because obviously, you sound like you're the official man for the yeah, wrap up. Yeah, I, I take on that now. Now I'm all that now. Ah. Yeah, uh, um, yeah rap man's cool for speaking here and there. Obviously, yeah. he's busy though doing his thing. Yeah. The thing about my big brother, he's always been very consistent. He's always made time for me. We've got a bit of an age gap, but he's never stopped him from treating me like an equal. He's always inspired me to do my best and to be artistic. Like, especially the hype on my really shitty drawings as a toddler. That has given me the confidence to be who I am right now. Without him, I'm not sure what I'd be right now. He's the definition of what a real brother is and should be. When I'm nine, I was my bigger bro, he always had the right mind, strategy and thought process for no matter whatever it could be. We like the challenge, we like to try and solve things, isn't me? I want to start getting this spitting on film. So I'm like, raw, RE, the hardest regardless. Gangster grime, rap, fire. Let me start filming you. Say no more. Be round here tonight and start getting the fire. So I come round there and I get RA and some of the hardest spitters this country's ever seen on tape. Spitting flames. Again, he don't ask me what have I got for him. What am I saying? He just lets me do my thing. Next thing you know, I'm DRD's TV in association with Block 5 on the YouTube. That's real, you get me? The five's real. We all know RA, Block 5, the hardest regardless. But through the years from then, three other spitters were fire. You had S-West, DRs, 
and riots. Yeah. They made up the block and they spat the fire as well. Yeah. I'm gonna ask you, what did you personally think of them as you got to know them and you heard their bars? You have to understand with, with like with the block five lot, yeah. You have to understand these are like back then they were like youth man that yeah that I grew around. Mm. Yeah, I watched them. I watched enough of them. Them youth they grow and I know that. You get me without once again without saying too much. They're serious youths. Yeah. You see what I'm saying to you? So when they're doing their music thing, I was you get me? Cause we we were just in in the mind frame of. You can't rap unless unless you're out here. Yeah. That was our mind frame. That's it. And they were really out here. Yeah. So whatever they did, it was like, you get me, like, you get me, it's self-explanatory. Yeah. Basically, you get me. So yeah, it was, you get me. Yeah, I definitely had a, a lot of admiration for them as young boys coming up and doing their thing. Yeah. You get me. Although DRs weren't 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 so, but compared to me, they were all young. Yeah. And DRs is fire. Uh, I'm not gonna go around and think Diaz lyrically. If you can catch what Diaz is saying, he's got a lot to say. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he got a lot to say. Yeah, Your bro's definitely fired. That's bro. Let me wrap this up, cut the crap, let's get to the facts and dump. Tell him how we got the sheets and chats and nothing. If you don't lie, just guess enough. Three deep in the ride, yeah, that's enough. Throw shells to a nigga from the passenger. Just arm in the middle, let's brass him up. Cold water that we settle hard on the pedal to the gasket. Where it was viewpoint. This is where it used to be. Everyone see everything. Yeah. The corners. Couldn't run up on Maddie, get me? Different. This was it, the slope. Five is real. Yeah. So who did you look to before yourselves? Like when you was young, young, who did you think, right, them man's really got this on lock? Remember there was the 28s? Yeah, yeah, yeah. There yeah was that was way before man. The, the before man's era, innit? Yeah. I never used to look up to no one like that. That's what I'm trying to say. It was just a couple of the, maybe the older men that was around, man. Yeah. And a couple of men like, one of my brothers that passed away, Rahim Allah, and a couple, yeah, a couple older men, just that used yeah. to live around here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But no one like that, bro. Man was, a, man was a rebel, you know? Man was yeah. his own thing. Let me give you another little entertainment story, you get me? Like, obviously, everyone knows I used to hit the block regular to get the fire, that block fire fire. So, obviously, one night I come down. Bear Donnie's on the block, you get me? All the real G's and all the rappers. You got Riots, you got S West, you got Batman, Bear Others, you get me? So there's a new Donnie, like I ain't seen him before. So he starts spitting now, the spitting's fire. I'm like, fucking hell, the next thing coming on, you get me? He's going in flames. So I get every fucking bar on the camera and then I put it out there for the public, you get me? People are like, nah, that done, it's hard, what's going on? We want more, we want more. So I come back to the block, I can't see him nowhere for weeks, months, you get me? Like, where's Donny at? So anyway, then one day I must say to someone like, right, where's that Donny who spit that night? Fire was coming out. Like, yeah, fuck that Donny, forget him. I'm like, what do you mean, what's going on? They're like, nah, that Donny weren't built for the five, you get me? coming round here spitting them flames then when it's time to do something my man's crumbling so I'm telling you that's how you knew this fucking block was serious for the fire if you weren't built for the flames you were spitting you had to fuck off you get me that's why I told you you don't get into shit you're not built for stay at home and look after your family because shit gets real serious out here I remember back I remember when I used to ring you and it's like I would be on the phone for an hour telling you how mad you are at it and it's like you'd say about three words like I'd be just chatting for an hour and your, your whole conversation would be say nothing you get me? it's like that's how you had it it's like your power was you, you don't talk but what I'm saying is there must be something inside you that says you know what there's, there's too much wasted talent like this road thing and how official you and your team was it's fucked up your lives in a way. Yeah, of course. Because you've lost 10. S West is gone. It was S West, RS, I'm back on the streets. It was real, recognized, real, I'm ready to die, homie. 08, blood and blood out, that's no lie, homie. Mean you got beefs when you see me, you better sky, homie. Before I rise the ting and burn your skin, that's no lie, homie. Whites has lost mad years. How do you feel about the way it's gone? You've lost mad years. RA's mob lost mad years. 
DRs has lost mad years. S West is still sitting in a cage. Like the fire you man gave the roles has been fucked up through the fact that you lot were so official on roles. What does that do to you on the real? Obviously it's gonna it's gonna affect you, bro, but uh, fake the fake people are always gonna make it no matter what. That's yeah. just how the game's rigged. It's just been like that. Nowadays you don't have to be that real person, you don't have to be organized, you don't have to be militant, bro. It's just you yeah. can act it out. And it's gonna come up, you're gonna blow up. Yeah. A, a youth today can be a YouTuber and then to war he can talk the, the hardest hardest killer shit. But because everyone's vibing to it, he's blown up the next day. Yeah. But the people that's actually lived it and nah man, they don't want us out there. Yeah. DR's is most mad years. It's fucked up a talent from four people because of how official you was. There must be times when you think, you know what, it's a madness. Yeah, of course. Like I said, when I came on the block now, it was emotion. Yeah. Like, right, I just remembered everything where certain things were. Yeah. Where certain men used to stand. And you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Certain men used to have their own spots where they used to like to stand. Yeah. Like, I, I remember the five, innit? You know what I'm saying? So, of course, I feel like that and I, and I feel it. And I always make the art for the brothers in jail. Yeah. They, um, but I'm saying, I can't sit here thinking about rock. Yeah, like, everyone yeah. used to have bars, everyone used to have bars. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. It's bigger than that now. So yeah. I've had a bit of 30 years, bro. That's what I've got to think about. Yeah. You know what I'm so, yeah, a lot of talent got wasted, but I'm here to kind of just try and hold it up by the collar. I am the problem. Not for these guns, I smacked up and rubbed them. One of the two, I strapped up and dropped them. Run out and shoot and clap, clap and swap them. I've been a creep in all black, I got them. Gunners will shoot off roof racks and rock them. Run a big gangster suit rap, I'm not them. Obviously, right now you've explained, listen, my license is this. A lot of man I can't fuck with. But we want to hear the words from you yourself. Riots is out here, big man. Yeah. Riots is spitting fucking fire. You don't want to see me coming. Act like you don't see, stop running. Actually freeze, I'm gunning. You better pray that the angels come. Duck six from the cigarette jump. Unload, reload, get it done. Shot gun to his face, never heard that shit. Stick so smooth, never heard that clip. Mention my name and I'm throwing you quick. DR's is out here, he's still got fire. My young niggas for the fire, we do up live, we do with sauce. Got my young, my young niggas inside, he's doing up time for doing up war. My niggas are riders, give you a nine, I'll give you a four. That's what they really wanna ride with a little nigga died and there was a short. Them man are block five, they're not road five. Right, right. What's good? Can we see a track with all three of you yeah, on it? Of course, why not? So that can happen. Yeah, that's nice. Because the fans want that. Riots, RA and DRs. The people are on me. They put in the comments, listen, we want to see RA, DRs and riots. Yeah. This is what we want, the real block five fire. Are we gonna get that? Well, of course it's coming, it's all in the paperwork. You know? it's just, I'm linking ours and that, no problem, you know? that's, that's coming up. Yeah. You know, he's doing his thing right now, but that's there. Yeah. Yeah, that's life. So I'm gonna that's ask you stuff. now, big man, I wanna boost that up on people. When could we get that? Any time, innit, right? Yeah. That's, that's little bro, the ours bro, like, obviously. We yeah. Would've, we would've went to studio today, you get me? But there's a little hiccup, you get me? That's yeah. Life. That's life. Yeah. Pattern. Uh, Never DRs is like, obviously DRs is busy with like, different things. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But we definitely get that look. So let me know, like, what was the first you ever heard of RA? What made you know, listen, this block's fire? What music was? Music was, yeah. Yeah. Probably that like, old, old 07, 08, 08, 09. When I was in school, man. Yeah. Probably tracks wise. Them freestyles, obviously. Freestyles on block five. Yeah. Freestyles on block five, innit? Flipping. R's, DR's, three of them. If, you see what's mad? I can't remember the first time I actually heard or what track it was, but yeah. tracks wise, it was blood and what. Clean up time is what it is. Before RA went jail to do the 10, the last track he done was a tune called Hard as Nails. So obviously, if you know that tune, you might know it from the Blood and Grot by My Chameleon. Nah, that's not where the tune was meant to be. It got on there because Elms ST gave it to My Chameleon to promote it on that album, or mixtape, should I say. But here's the real story of how that tune came about. Basically, this road here is off of Cold Arbor Lane. You get me? Near to Loughborough Junction. This is where I met R.A. 
like he called me. So I flew around here in the car, pulled up right where we're talking now. He's come over, jumped in the car with a disc. The disc had the tune on it. You get me, the one where he talks about Susie Uzi. Yeah, fire. So anyway, he jumps in the car, we have a little chat, I play the tune. The tune's fucking bonkers, I'm going nuts. So if you do your research and you know the game properly, that tune was first put on War on the Road. Brixton Pink, Brixton Pink, beat them, itch them, itch them, they got jewels, stick them, stick them, pink. We got them bagger and tin and spray sprays. And we'll kick them pins. Listen. I can't let it slide, I see them niggas, I go get my knife. The CD that I put out. Mixtape that I put out. If you look up on YouTube, I've got an old account called The Artist Production. It's on there to prove dates. You get me? So that's how that tune first came about. Fresh from the studio, RA gave me that. No one else had that first. Obviously, he done the, the freestyle, innit? Down on Grease Block. That was meant to go on Cocaine Sick. But obviously, it never happened because Mike and Million had the link, innit? And obviously Tanner, um, I think Devious and Soros all had links with French Montana. So it was supposed to go on the Cocaine City, that freestyle. That shit was legendary, but for some reason it never got there. Because when I let it rain, I use these little pussies as a target practice. They're the ones shooting at the legs when they palm and clack. They're the ones talking to the feds when they ask you clap to. I aim at the head, neck, back and chest and rip up his Prada jacket Come to the Gaza Strip, the Sava piece, my doggies pack it C50 on my young shooters in their army jackets Love the Ruger Rail, but Susie Uzi's fully automatic So anyway, I've took that track And I'm flying round to mum's in Foxhall So I'm busting the track all the way there I get to Foxhall now And about six Donnies that are official in Peckham they're waiting outside mums to see me. So I don't know they're there because no one ain't chat to me on the phone or nothing. So I'm just busting into Foxhall. You get me, the tune's going nuts in the car, full speed ahead. All of a sudden, them Peckham Donnies hear the tune. And I kid you not, every one of them is a Giggs fan. And every one of them was going bonkers about you fucking nuts, D. I want the first copy of that. That tune is fire. So yeah, there's another little story time for you, you get me? That tune there started going bonkers in Peckham. And I'll tell you why I know that. Because I fucking gave it to Bear Man. There was Bear Man in Peckham that I used to link to give mixtapes. They wanted that. So yeah, that's the truth on that tune there. Hard as an else. Yeah, yeah. those two mixtapes, one man heard those two mixtapes. It's like, it's not even being biased, but like, you know that? Cause man, this cause man, at the time man's young, you see listening to Grime, Channel U, all of these things, this and that. But it's like when man's hearing the people from man's hood now, man's strip, hearing their music and that, comparing it to the to what man's hearing on Channel U and that, or what man's yeah. people, school friends or that are listening to, I'm thinking, what that? These are like, these are ain't got nothing on the man them like that. The man them are really. Right, really yeah. living what they're what they're rapping kind of thing. Yeah. Like, on top of it, you get me? On top of that, they they were good as well. So it's like that's it's, it's not even if or but. It's definitely the man them that made. It's definitely the man them that made men start rapping. Personally, I would say that. Obviously, I can't speak for all of the man them, but majority of the man them. It's definitely, I'm sure they'll say the same thing kind of thing. Innit? I'm gonna give you a little story from back in the day. So obviously. The whole of this bit is the five, you get me? This is Lilford Road I'm on now. One time I'm in the SLK, I bust onto Lilford Road trying to get that entertainment money. Couple of customers at the bottom of this road waiting. And I'm waiting for that dough. So I bust onto the road now. All I hear is pop, pop. I'm like, what the fuck's that? I see bits of brick wall, you get me? Just popping out. So I'm looking around, I see Donnie's flying all over the place. I'm like, what the fuck's going on here? So someone shouts out, D, it's kind of peak right now around here. So I'm like, yeah, say nothing, big man, but I've got a clutch, you get me? I'm on the journey. 
He's like, no, get out of here. So obviously, I don't know who it was who said that to me to get me. I just heard a voice, voice in the wind. But anyway, I carried on the journey, just dodging through the block five, you get me? Trying to get to the entertainment. But that's just a little quick something to show you, listen, it was peak round here. You get me? Bullets were flying. It's a madness. I tell the kids, stay at home. Watch some of that entertainment. That's what I was on. I'm gonna say one more name out here. Obviously, you never done this spitting thing, but you can't mention the block without mentioning gravy. Oh, different. He's a weird little go getter. If he wants something, he'll get it. You get me? Big homie. It's not just a random title we're giving him. You get me? Sweet. Had a strict pan. Cousin. Nice. One way in, one way out. You know, you know. You think bad now, gravy's your brother, you get me? I'm gonna tell people what I know. Because you get me, this game here, there's a lot of fake Donnies who will say things, they're not keeping it 100. I remember when you was in jail, and I'm seeing Gravy on road, and I'm like, well, where you going? I'm going to see my brother, Ah, oh, You get me? He was keeping this shit official, he was coming to see you when you were sitting in that cage. Obviously he had next man from the, the fives with him, but he kept that shit thorough until he obviously ended up in there. Like, that's real. You get me? If you're with man from the beginning, you're with man in the end. So what do you say when you think yeah, about man that's, like Gravy? That's little bro, man. That's what all the time. Yeah. Um, make the world for me all the time. Yeah. 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 Um, of course, that's what I'm saying. Emotional. When I come on the block, I'm looking. I'm saying, yeah. bro. I remember where bro used to pattern. And you don't have to say that's bro. Yeah. Like, and like, the man, that was lieutenant. You don't have to say yeah. when I when I when I stepped out. So yeah, he had this thing covered. Yeah, he had it, he had it, he had it patterned. So yeah, free him up. Obviously, he's innocent. So uh, you hear what the man said. Sharp. Big up man like gravy. I remember little situations where man was driving with gravy. You get me? <laughs> we had to come back to the block because we went somewhere. I'm not going to say where, but he had the wrong <laughs> shoes on. You get me? A man had to drive him back to the block to get them kicks right. So yeah, big yeah, up gravy. gravy. You don't know, the game's dirty. Free up SOS. Free yeah. Up Mantle, and, other things like and trust me, this PC, this gave the world something. They ain't never getting again. Like the man said, that generation's dead. Pair me into these pricks, so you stupidly mad. And you're lucky you ain't dead. You're stupidly glad. Shoot in comparison, me I'm the hardest. Aim so sick, one call and leave a red tip. Murder scene, bitch when the burns scream. Jump out the four by four, act up and put get four by the four. The government's fucking people right now. So it's harder to get money, yeah. So you tell me, like the youths are out here, they're starving. They want that nice stuff. What's the next move for them? Education, bro. Yeah. But while they're doing that, they want them Jordans, you get me? They want that coat. Then you can do your local side hustle. You can do a legit side hustle all day, bro. I see yeah. the young bucks now doing like different side hustles like yeah um working in um like trainer shops doing tr um, trainer retailing buying and selling trainers i see some little youths doing that <laughs> yeah you're going to you. yeah and they're making change so if you if you want your jordans and whatever whatever you got and you're ambitious then you're going to do something like that isn't it? yeah you're going to pattern up you're going to go you can do it the right way you're going to say the guy in brixton john i see big bro in there you get me gas gas that's how i banged up with him I was getting everything I wanted, I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, I'm going to the survey, I'm getting anything on the survey that like, no one's even chatting shit. And there's man that's older than Big Go, like they weren't even chatting shit. Like old school Britson Dons, whatever, you get me? But I'm getting everything, man was mad. People in the line was mad. Like, imagine I've just come into the joint, you know, so I should be on default. Like, okay, I'm getting whatever I want. Popping off. I see big bro pop off like three, four watches, you hear me? <laughs> In less than 10 minutes. He gave me the, um, the aqua though, remember I had the aqua, the green thing, you hear me? Yeah, he gave me that. That's what the aqua was in style though. That's what it, that's what, yeah, aqua was, aqua was the thing, you hear me? Yeah, yeah, I got that. I think I gave it to my solicitor to take out, you man. Big up everybody on any block that's real and looks after what matters. Soon back with that part two. The artist TV in association with Block Five. Walk with.
we know the pain Know the hustle, know the game Know the front, there's no shame Know the gaps, we know to aim Pass from 357 to your brain, your chain We got guys that bring back hope for the plane Not for the holiday, just for the cane Not for the fame, just to maintain on a block with a cane Buy more guns and pop more chains Bear shots, but it doesn't like rice grains When I burst a ting, one ice strain I'm on a block with an over cane And a brewing chain, I blew my body It fills your brain up, still a kid, I kill when I aim Recognize I'm big in the game Soon we're gonna be big in the music game Fuck the music fame, what is after the music change?